Hi, my name is Kaylin and this is my very first YouTube video for my makeup channel. Um, well I guess I can't say it's a full makeup channel. I want my channel to have a lot of different things for people. I'm going to do cooking videos, weight loss videos, bullying videos. Um, but before we get into all of that, uh, let me introduce myself. Like I said, my name is Kaylin. I am 17 years old and I am a junior in high school. I love makeup, dance, fashion, um, shopping, nails, hair, everything like that. And I also love baseball. I'm a little bit of a tomboy in that aspect. Um, so you guys will probably see some videos on that. Um, what else can I say? I've been a dancer for 17 years. 17 years sorry 14 years um and it's really my passion in life and that's what I want to do when I'm older and I after I graduate I'll be moving to New York City to pursue that dream and hopefully continue YouTube so I decided that for my first video I'm going to do a kind of comparison slash review video of the MAC heroin lipstick and the Maybelline Vivid's Brazen Berry Lipstick. They're both very vivid purples and one is definitely more expensive than the other and I wanted to help you guys maybe get a little bit of an aspect of if it's worth it to spend the money on the MAC or go with the drugstore. So let's get started with a couple swatches. This is the MAC Lipstick in Heroin. As you can see, I've used this one. Um, it is a matte finish, and it runs for, I think, $16 at MAC. I got this as a gift. It's something that I wanted for a really long time, and I absolutely adore it. So, see the swatch here? That's what that looks like. It's very dark, and it's definitely a more daring color. So if you want something to kind of spice up your look or maybe you're going for a vampy look, I know it's winter so these dark colors are really in, then this is what you want to kind of go with. And I'll tell you right now, if you have dark hair and really pale skin like I do, it looks awesome. I think it's this one or another one that Lord wears. I think she's worn it before with Cyber. There was a video that I saw on that lip combo. So the next lipstick is the Maybelline Vivids in Brazen Berry, number 905. I'll be backwards to you guys. Um, but this one I just got at Ulta. You see that? Because it's on sale right now. They're having a sale on L'Oreal, Garnier, and Maybelline. Every it's buy one get one half off. So go to Ulta and check that out. This one is not a matte, it is more of a sheen kind of color, so we'll swatch this. Okay, and as you can see, it's lighter than heroin. It's um, not as pigmented as well. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, but in the aspect of how they go on, this one definitely goes on smoother and um, not as, if you can see, it's kind of more even than the heroin where it's kind of patchy. So when it comes to the pigmentation, I would definitely say if you want it to be more bold, heroin, but this one would be the brazen berry would be more for an everyday sort of look. And I'm not saying like, oh, like wear this to school, but I mean, play with it. Um, sorry, my chair is a little messed up. Um, you know, play with your look. Don't be afraid to experiment with color. So now uh, I'm going to try and smudge them and see how well they come off. I have no primer, no liner, none of that on it. So we'll see here. So they smudge about evenly. We'll pull them opposite directions now, that way, and then we'll go this way. So as you can see, they smudge pretty well, so you're probably going 
to need uh, maybe a lip primer or base or you know something like that. I know that Too Faced makes a lip insurance. Um, personally speaking, with these, I would go with heroin. I don't think it's worth the sixteen dollars, but if you really want pigment and something matte, then this is one of the best ones out there. And you're not gonna find this color on the market in most cases. It's most people have, um, you know, the nudes and the pinks are really in right now. And this one is just a gorgeous, unique, dark color. And, you know, you're just not going to find it anywhere else. And the Raisinberry, it's good. But I feel like it's one of those lipsticks that you're going to have to reapply, reapply, reapply. Where the... I haven't worn the Raisinberry, so this is also kind of a first impressions one. But I know that this one stays on all the time without anything underneath it. I don't even put chapstick underneath it, nothing, and it stays put. So, yeah, I guess that's my little review. Thank you so much for watching, and subscribe, like, comment. Um, hopefully I'll be doing videos at least once a week. Um, I'm just getting started, so it's a lot of figuring out the lighting, the setup. So please comment down below if... Um, you know, the lighting's too dark, too light. Um, if you want to see anything on my makeup I have on today, I don't know if you guys can see it like that. It's really neutral. I didn't have a ton of time this morning. Um, but I will have two makeup tutorials coming up for you guys that will have some kind of intense, fun colors, which I'm really excited about. And, oh, one more thing. My fingers are purple. Um... <laughs> If you are looking for some new YouTubers to kind of watch, I will link some people down below. Uh, there's a YouTuber who lives really close to me who is super nice and like the most amazing lady ever. She has been doing YouTube for, I want to say a couple years, a year, over a year. Uh, her, name, her YouTube name is Rosa's Beauty and Fashion. She does amazing videos. Um, she's always telling you guys, you know, where to find the bargain makeup that's still really good. Um, and she posts all the time and she's like me, she shoots on an iPad and, you know, she's just amazing and I want to help get her as many subscribers as possible because she's kind of the one who said like, you know, don't be afraid to start your YouTube, just start it. So, my phone went off. Um, that's what I'm doing. So... I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Like, comment, and subscribe down below. Oh, and happy Groundhog's Day. Look at that. Um, yeah, so tell me if you like this video and comment suggestions for more videos. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.